Hello everyone, Rich Conrad of Remax Preferred Choice and today's uh, dot loop tutorial will be on how to split a document into multiple files. Now I would like to thank Patty Cottrell for showing me how to do that. I do appreciate that. And uh, this tutorial should probably only be three minutes, not too long, so let's begin. As we see, I already created a test account, 2525 West Test Account. And to, as most everyone here knows how to, uh, all you have to do to simply move the document from outside dot loop is click on the add document button. I'm going to click on my computer. I'm going to choose a file. And we see the document within the escrow folder. Now what I'm going to do is, this is actually three documents within one. So we have the buyer inspection. We have the LSU. And that would be, uh, well, buyer inspection on page 1 to 3, LSU on page 4 and 5. And then after page 5 right here, we have the inspection report. So and that's on page 6 through, that would be 14. So to split a document, all we have to do is click on the other actions, click on split document. And right now we have a split document, or split splitting document example. It says we're going to split documents. Uh, the default is two, but really we will have three separate documents. So I'm going to change this from two to three. And for file name, this would be the first document. I'm just going to call this a Benzer. And that would be from page one to page three. File two name is LSU. And once again, that'll be on page four to five. And if you forget what the pages are, all you have to do is scroll up, and you see right here, page six. You go up a little bit far farther. Now we're on page five. So this is where you keep track of the pages. And for file name three, I'm just going to call this inspection report. And I'll go to page uh, six through. 14. So it automatically knows, knows how many pages is within this document. I'm going to click on split document. And now I'm going to click the back button right here. And whereas before it said something to the effect of splitting example, now we have the inspection report, Benzer, and LSU. And if there's a document that uh, you do not need to submit because it's a required form, you can either move this to a different folder or what I'm going to do is just simply archive it. And there you go. That's how you split a document. If you have any questions, please feel free to give me a call or shoot me an email. Telephone number is 623-414-4502 or the email richconrad at rmpcaz.com. And have a great day. Take care.